Oh yeah, I'm going there. Two black mages around the round side. Around the outside. Two black mages around the black side. Whoa. Hell, oh, YouTubers and all those who happen to watch. Poke. Two black mages are done. One's reserved. I was going to have three, but sadly I forgot to put the paper on there that's required to do it, and I wasn't paying attention because I was watching something, and I kind of put the iron down on it, and, like, it was a mess, let's put it that way. So, basically one black mage is all set and ready to ship. So, if you want it, just let me know, and I'll set up the eBay auction and give you the, give you the link, and uh, you can purchase it that way. That's, that's what me and my uh, associate are thinking. Uh, pardon me of how we're gonna start doing it now it's only by request as soon as you request it we'll go and make it then we'll give you a uh, eBay link then you can purchase it that way now if you can't do it through eBay then we'll have to negotiate something around um, PayPal if you can't do PayPal then I would have to rediscuss it against my my associate is not quite speaking to me about the, or hasn't really talked about it, but money orders and all that stuff are kind of iffy because we're trying to keep it so that way we can keep it all in the organization process. So far we got a pretty nice guy, uh, Loferus. I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name, man. But uh, he uh, made a couple purchases, so we're going to be shipping that out to him very soon. Also, um, one person from Candy. I call it Canada, but from Candy, wanted a black mage, so I went to go make a couple. So, again, black mage is done. I'm sorry, I'm eating some caramel candy. My blood sugar is going a little bit low. I'm not diabetic or anything, just I have a little blood sugar sometimes. Kind of works having no iron in your blood, huh? <laughs> but, this one's for you, bud. Just, he's waiting for a good home. Again, someone asked a question on how we ship it. Um, we find the most affordable way to ship it, which is uh, through a small parcel envelope. And we put two cardboard pieces on this to protect it, and we ship it. Now, a disclaimer is that you got to be really careful with these things, guys. Um, don't obviously bend it, because that's going to break it pretty much. But, again, be very delicate with these things, and uh, they'll go a long time. Some ideas and suggestions for them. If you have a computer desk case or whatever, and you want to, you know, kick it up a notch, put some characters on there. See? Use some... Um, what is it called? I'm trying to think of the name of it. It's a graph. It's a piece of paper you use up from a stop sign. Uh, but what you could do, if you're really artistic, is, you know, make a background for it, and then put these characters on there. With a little bit of Velcro. Then for those certain areas on the thing, unvelcro it off and switch it up with a different character. You know, make a little anime or not an, an animation with it. It's a pretty cool idea. Well, I thought of using a little character and covering up his delf, uh, uh, what do they call these, talisman thing here. And uh, covering it up with a character like this. Or, you're really creative and... A little Mega Man head or something like that right here, and then press the Mega Man head in when you want to turn it on and off, which is another idea um, going through my head with this type of stuff. Because this stuff you can decorate your room with. You can, God, I, I feel like that guy for the Sham Wow. Jesus. Oh, I can't do this all day. See, look at that. It's a piece of plastic. Nah. Um. <laughs> but again, those are all set. Hope you guys enjoyed looking at them. I like to show these off because they're pretty create cute. So. Well, take it easy, folks.